I'm, I'm a hostage and uh, this villa has been converted into a jail. The police threatened me that they would take me outside and shoot me if I didn't cooperate with them. I'm in a villa, I'm, I'm a hostage, and uh, this villa has been converted into a jail. All the windows are barred shut, I can't open any window. Uh, there's five policemen outside and two policewomen inside the house, and uh, I can't even go outside to get any fresh air. Um, no release date, and I don't know what my conditions will be like after I'm released. Um, so basically I'm a hostage. Um, so when they kidnapped me on March 4th, 2018, they put me in Al Awir jail. Uh, I was in section 13 and the label outside my room said 291, my cell, so I think it was cell 291 or whatever, I don't know. And they moved me here on May 27 and uh, I've been here ever since, so uh, more than a year now. I've been by myself, solitary confinement, um, no access to medical help. Um, no trial, no charge, um, nothing. They want to, they want me to break and they want propaganda from me. They wanted me to do a video and say that I'm here happily and voluntarily and I refused, you know. They wanted me to say a lot of things and I refused and um, because I wouldn't cooperate with them because I, I didn't let them break me. I'm being punished and um, I don't know what can happen to me and how long this will last and if they decide to release me, like how my life will be, but um, I'm not safe at all. I've been in prison now for 14 months and uh, basically I'm a hostage and I don't know when I'll be released and what the conditions will be like when I'm released. Um, every day I am worried about my safety and my life. Um, don't really know if I'm going to survive the situation. Uh, the police threatened me that they would take me outside and shoot me if I didn't cooperate with them. They also threatened me that I'll be in prison my whole life and I'll never see the sun again. The situation is very hard, but um, I have hope and I'm not giving up, especially since uh, I have like Tina fighting for me and David and so many other people who are doing amazing and you know like I shouldn't give up. They're not giving up. Why should I give up? Subscribe and press the bell icon for more brute videos.